Hey, what's up guys? So Tesla just reduced the price of the Model Y by $3,000. I'm very happy about that because I have one on reservation and I haven't taken delivery yet. So a few months back, I made a video on the top four reasons to delay my Model Y order. Number one was I didn't need the car right now until the other lease is up. Number two was wait for them to flush out any potential issues. Number three was possible million mile battery. And number four was potential incentives for the Model Y of examples like free supercharging possibly or lowering the price of the car or getting free upgrades on the rims or things of that nature so i'm very happy that one of those things happened so basically the price was lowered so all i had to do was literally just go to tesla.com log into my account okay so all you need to do is click on edit design now if you need to make changes feel free to make changes if you don't want to make changes and you just want to get the new lower price, all you need to do is basically click next and then click next and basically next and next. And at the end, you're going to see the purchase price you're agreeing to. So if you got the super basic one with, you know, the white one with just a dual motor, you're going to see 49990 so and then all you do is just click update design i got the one with the tow hitch that's so actually a thousand dollars more but it's cheaper than what it was previously when i had it on reservation so all you do is just you're just going to click on update design when you do it's going to reflect this newer lower price so when you do that and you actually go here then you're good to go so you got the new lower price and yeah that's all you need to do so the other cool thing about reserving it is the fact that when you reserve it, if the price goes up, you're locked into the lower price. If the price goes down and you know that the price went down, all you have to do is click on this edit design and then update the, your, your design to get the new lower price. And then once you see the price is reflected here, that's the price you're agreeing to pay. Now, if the model Y goes up to 70 grand tomorrow, I'm still paying this price. So that's actually the cool thing about reserving it because you're always locked in. You're almost, almost guaranteed to always get the lowest price just so as long as you know that a lower price is available. Now, on another perspective, for those of you guys who just ordered the Model Y, who just got it either a few weeks ago, a few days ago, or like a month ago, yeah, I'm going to say... You know, it's not the best news for you guys uh, in a sense because, you know, you just got this car and they lowered the price. So, but I feel your pain because I actually bought a Model 3 Performance very early on. I was one of the first to get the Model 3 Performance when it came out. I got it early August of 2018. So, you know, shortly after I got it, they reduced the price and then they reduced the price again after they lowered the federal tax incentives. So pretty much after I got it, whoever got it after me got a lower price. And on top of getting a lower price, you also pay lower tax, you pay lower registration fees, at least in California you do. And, you know, I feel your pain. That's what I'm trying to say. But I basically use that as a learning opportunity. And, and that's kind of what I did with the Model Y. That I'm like, you know what, I won't get it right away if I don't need it. Now, obviously, if you need the car, there's really not much you can do about it. But anyways, but yeah, if you guys have the car in a reservation, you don't need to cancel it. All you really need to do is edit the design, update the design, and you're good to go. So let me know what you guys think. Is this good? Is this bad? Do you think this will drive up sales? And do you think they might have free supercharging or lower the price of the car even more? A few months later or at the end of the year what do you guys think let me know in the comment sections below as always thank you guys for watching thank you to all my current subscribers and if you're not a current subscriber hit that subscribe button down below for new tech and tesla videos every single week thank you